homicides in three separate locations. Now Raleigh Police and the Wake County Sheriff's Office are investigating. Let's get to CBS 17's Colleen Quigley, who's live at a business near Capitol Boulevard where that body was found inside the business. Colleen. Angela, and in the last 10 minutes, I did just get a breaking news update from the Wake County Sheriff. We know that the crime that happened here is related to two other crimes in Wake County, one of them being a homicide at Alta Vista Court. The Sheriff Department telling us they now have the suspect for that homicide in custody. Let's show you his photo if we can. This is the mugshot for Evan Small. Again, the Wake County Sheriff saying he is in custody this afternoon. He was apprehended in Wake Forest and that there was a brief chase in which Small hit a Raleigh police vehicle. Vehicle. The Wake County Sheriff Office telling us while he is a suspect in that Alta Vista court homicide, he may be connected with the two cases being investigated by Raleigh police. So I want to walk you through what we know about these three homicides, which again, we've been told are all connected. All of this started with a welfare check at a home on Bentley Meadow Lane Monday night, where a 79 year old woman was found dead by Raleigh police. And that crime scene led to this business on Fairview Road, where an 80 year old man was found dead. RPD then asked the Wake County Sheriff to check out that home on Alta Vista Court. That is where a third person was found dead inside a home. We had a chance to speak with friends of the victims who say they are all members of the same family and will be missed. They give you the shirt off their back. They took people in. They helped people. They just were great people. Again, all three victims found late Monday night, but neighbors at that Alta Vista home say they hadn't seen the man who lived there recently. The sheriff's office said it appeared the person had been dead inside the home for at least a few days. Now back live now in Raleigh again. Minutes ago, we learned the suspect in the Alta Vista court homicide, Evan Small, has been taken into custody by the Wake County Sheriff, and he may be the same person of interest in connection to those other two homicides in Raleigh. For now, reporting live in Raleigh, Colleen Quigley, CBS 17 News.